Okay, what's up everybody? RBA LEGO guy here coming right back at you with another speed build and review video for Harry Potter LEGO set 75958 as Boobaton's arrival or carriage arrival at Hogwarts. I'm pretty stoked on this. This was the little second wave of the new Harry Potter sets. I think it only came out about a month after uh, the main wave and so this is, this, is, this is the last one I have to do which is exciting and also upsetting because who doesn't love the Harry Potter theme? This theme is so cool and I am so excited that they started to do some new sets of this. I wasn't collecting when the original sets came out and so to finally be able to pick these up and to uh, just collect them, I'm so excited because all of the original uh, line of Harry Potter sets are super duper expensive uh, second hand so yeah I am pumped on this uh, yeah I'm gonna get started because I just I'm I have no words for how excited on this it looks really cool it looks like it has a lot of features that I'm excited for and it looks like the playability is gonna be really good so I'm gonna get started now <laughs> Alright, so that's Bobaton's carriage arrival at Hogwarts. This thing is pretty super rad. I love it. Uh, <laughs> um, 
Lots of cool little features, just really, really cool all in all. Um, you got your cool, uh, like, I guess these are Pegasuses, Pegasi, I don't know how to say that. But you got Miss Bobaton, you got Fleur de Cantur, I probably said that wrong, and I believe that's her sister. Also Hagrid, with the things that he paddles, he like, uh, uh, gets them, I, I don't know what that's called, he, he leads them into the runway or whatever at Hogwarts with. But this thing is super cool. You little hood thing comes off here and you can bring this up. So it's kind of like a living quarters for, uh, for Bobaton school. Um, really cool, just awesome little details. Uh, you got a little place setting in here uh, with just a teacup and a tea kettle. And then you have a little uh, uh, chest right here with three cups in it really cool all in all very excited for this set um, you know I got this for $30 or $35 I believe and I definitely think I would have paid the $50 for it um, just it's, it's really cool it's just kind of low it's 430 pieces so for $50, uh, the price, uh, the piece count is not great, but, you know, I'm crazy about Lego, so <laughs> I, I have no problem spending a little extra on it, but I'm, I'm super pumped on it. Let me know what you think about this set. Let me know what you think about the two new ones, the uh, uh, Voldemort's Return or uh, the Rise of Voldemort and the Bobatons carriage and arrival at Hogwarts. Let me know down in the comments what you think of these two sets, what sets you'd like to see them make. I'm really interested in that. Um, there's a bunch that I would like, but you know, I'm, I'm still considering buying that Hogwarts castle, the micro, micro scale one. Um, it's just so expensive and I just, I don't know. I don't know if I can do it. It's $400, I believe, but I don't know. I want it. <laughs> I want it, but I don't have the funds for that. Or if I did, I would have to just not buy sets for a few months, which sounds like an easy task. But uh, again, I'm kind of a psycho when it comes to buying Lego sets. So we'll see if that ever happens, but super pumped on it. Let me know what you think of my videos. Let me know what you think of this set down in the comments. All my other social media stuff will be down in the description. Thank you so much for watching my videos. And as always, have a wonderful day and happy building. Bye.